not hot? No, it's not hot yet. No. Do you know what we're doing today, bud? No. Are we going to do some science? Yes. Yeah. Are we going to do some art? I think we're going to do science. We're going to do science, but it's like art science. The science of art. So, we are going to use this. Can you, can you tell everyone what this is? The paint root? Yeah. Did you dig this up with Daddy? Yes. Yeah, do you know what it's called? Um, no. It's called matter root. Yeah. Did we dig this up today or a long time ago? I think a long time ago. A long time ago, so it's dry now. So we waited for it to dry out so we can get a deeper color. All right. And then we also have some potash. This is called potassium carbonate. What's it look like? Um, uh, salt. Salt. You're right. It's, uh, it is a salt. So we have potassium carbonate and then water. It's good to use distilled water. Distilled water is really, really clean. It doesn't have any uh, chemicals in it and it doesn't have any um, minerals in it. This is actually... Uh, from our you mean, you mean, dehumidifier. You mean the, the water you can drink? You could drink this water, but I wouldn't. Yeah. I wouldn't drink this water, but because it's in this yucky bucket. Uh, but this is from our dehumidifier, which is it's good water for what we're doing. So when you're doing science. When you're doing chemistry, you should have a recipe. This is our recipe. It's kind of like cooking. So I have this recipe book. It looks like it looks like that I have my paint recipes in. Hey, it looks like it looks like you can read the book. You can. So this is, says Rose Matter Lake, which means we're making a laked pigment, which you don't need to know what that means. But um, and it has here one gram of potash. That's this one gram of potash to every 2.6 grams of matter root. And that's our roots here. Mm -hmm. To every 40 milliliters of water. Yeah, that's so, the water that we see. But we have more than 2.6 grams of matter cup? root. Oh, this is, this is a measure cup. This is a measure cup, you're right. So I figured out how much matter root we have and how much will fit in this crock pot. So we are going to be using uh, 308 grams of matter, which means we need 128 ounces, or it's 3,785 milliliters of water for 308. Hey, when we, when I want to do it. Which that's actually not the right math. I'm just using half of my matter, so I'm actually using a little bit more. I want to do it. I want to do it. Okay, but I have to get it measured out. See, it needs to be right here on the 16. 16 ounces. Now what is on? That's good. Can you pour it in there? Pour it in. You have to be careful. Don't don't try not to spill any. We're gonna do eight of these. Can you help me count? One. Well, we already, yeah, we already did one. Two. Two. All right. Two. Three.
Yeah, yeah I still have pajamas on too, bud. Huh? It's because it's because it's a lazy day. I heard six. What number is this? Um, five, six. Six. I have two more. Seven, eight. So that's our 3,700 milliliters of water. Now we need 90. Oh, it's way five, far down. It's way far down. 95 grams of potassium carbonate. Oh, 95. That's what the, I, I already measured this out. So if you're going to be doing a lot of this kind of stuff, it's good to get a scale. And I I got a scale from the post office. Okay. Did you know they sell scales at the post office? No. They tell you how much things weigh. No. They're really good. All right, so we're gonna pour that in there. Get your face away. You really should be wearing glasses or goggles when you do this. Make sure we get it all in there. But now you can just see it all in there, right? So what do we gotta do? I don't know. What do we gotta do to get it all mixed in? It looks like steam. It looks like steam? Yeah. Let's get something to stir it with. Yeah. But, I, I want to stir it. Okay, but we have to stir it slowly. Okay. See, look, we're going to stir it slowly like this. And that's good. Maybe a little bit faster. Okay, but make sure you're like stirring the whole thing. There we go. Steam. Why do we need to make steam? Oh, it's not steam. It's just the salt is dissolving into the water. And this makes a really salty solution. I thought we were going to make steam. Here, can I do it? Mm -hmm. I still see some... It doesn't smell very good. Get your face away. <gasps> there we go. Now, now what are you in? Now, there's only one more ingredient that we're going to use right now. Why? And that's our matter root. Oh, matter root. So this is 308 grams of matter root. So can you help me put that in there? We're gonna go real slow. The matter root, some of it got a little bit uh, moldy, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. We can, I wanna stir it. We're gonna go real slow. We gotta get it to go down into the water. It floats. So I actually have a little bit more matter than I than the recipe calls for. Um, it's better to have too much than too little, uh, but that's because I'm. It, it was close to half. I don't know. I only needed like two hundred eighty-five. You don't know what I'm making. No. What is Daddy always making? Sugar. Sugar. Oh yeah, I do bake a lot of things with sugar. That's true. Uh, but what am I? What do I make? We're downstairs in the basement. Paint! Paint, that's right. Yay, we're making paint! We are making paint. Yay! So the next thing I need to do is I need to heat this up for 36 hours. 36 
36 hours. Hey, that says yes, D-O. It does say do. Um, so I have this little ink bird temperature regulator thingy. So this measures how hot it is. So what I'll do with this bud what? is, what see how it has a suction cup here? No. You see that suction cup? No, I do. So that suction cup, I can suction to the side. And you see this right here? No. This here no. is a thermostat. Right here, right here. So I can stick that down inside the water and put the suction part right here. It'll stay okay. Hey, hey, I do that on the, I do that on the suction sometimes. So that thermostat is down in the water. So when this is plugged in, I can plug this into the wall. Plug this into the wall? Yeah. And I can set what temperature I want it to go to on here. And then I plug the crock pot into here and it will heat up. And when it reaches the temperature on here that I want it to be, this will turn off. And then it will be And then when it gets hot. when it gets a little bit cooler, it'll turn it on again. So it'll keep it at one temperature. So I'm gonna put this, it needs to be between uh, 40 and 45 degrees Celsius for 36 hours. 36 hours? 36 hours. Do you know how long 36 hours is? No. It's a day and a half. Oh, a day and a half. Yeah. <laughs> uh, because it's just below boiling. It should, it needs to be, which 45 degrees Celsius is quite a bit below boiling. <laughs> So I'm going to double check that temperature. That's what I have written in, in here. So it's probably right, but I'm going to double check. So that'll heat it up so that it's hot enough. So there's a chemical inside the matter root that we want to get out. And the chemical inside is called alizarin. But if we boil it, it'll change the color of the alizarin. Where are you going? Okay, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to plug this in and let it sit for 36 hours. And then uh, from there, we will do, after that, we'll do the next part. So that's all we're doing today, bud. Does it feel like we did science? Does it feel like we did some science today? It doesn't feel like we did the whole science. We didn't do the whole science. Sometimes science takes a long time. We, it's fun to do experiments that are like really fast, but this one takes a long time. It takes a day and a half, and then after that, it will take another three days. So it takes almost a week. Well, and then after that, it takes like another, like probably at least a week. Well, and after that, maybe another week. So maybe like three weeks, and then and then we'll have pigment that we can make into paint. Okay. I I just want to do it right now. Oh, I know. But we'll have to wait. All right. So that's what we're do we're gonna do. We're gonna set it and uh, come back to it tomorrow. Turn it in a while. Why do you turn it in a while? Oh, we're gonna. Say bye.